Yellowstone volcano erupts. USGS issues urgent statement. Scientists have long known that Yellowstone National Park sits atop a huge supervolcano. In a shocking and unprecedented turn of events, the Yellowstone volcano erupted today, sending plumes of ash, smoke, and molten rock into the skies over Wyoming. The eruption, which occurred early this morning, caught many by surprise despite increased seismic activity in the region over recent weeks. The United States Geological Survey USGS, has classified the eruption as a significant geological event, triggering widespread concern across the nation. Ash clouds have reportedly risen over 30,000 feet into the atmosphere, disrupting air travel in the region and prompting immediate evacuations of nearby towns and Yellowstone National Park. The event unfolds. Witnesses described the eruption as deafening, with the ground shaking violently moments before the volcano's summit unleashed its fiery wrath. Thick columns of ash and pyroclastic flows have reportedly blanketed areas surrounding the park, forcing emergency services into action to rescue stranded residents and visitors. Everything turned dark. It was like nightfall in the middle of the day, said one evacuated tourist. The ash was everywhere, and you could feel the heat from miles away. USGS speaks out. In a press conference held this afternoon, USGS spokesperson Dr. Elena Ramirez addressed the nation. The eruption at Yellowstone today marks a significant geological event, Dr. Ramirez stated. While the caldera system has been under heightened observation due to seismic and thermal anomalies, this eruption exceeds our projections in scale and impact. We are working tirelessly to assess the immediate and long-term consequences. Dr. Ramirez emphasized that while the eruption's intensity is alarming, it does not appear to be the catastrophic supervolcanic event often feared. However, she cautioned that the situation remains dynamic and further eruptions are possible. The earth has start to look down. So Impacts and precautions. Provided access to fluid inclusions. The ash fallout has created hazardous air quality conditions as far as Montana and Idaho, with authorities urging residents to stay indoors and wear protective masks. Roads in and around the park are closed and emergency shelters have been set up for those displaced by the eruption. The National Weather Service has issued ashfall advisories, warning of potential respiratory risks, contamination of water supplies, and disruptions to agriculture. Meanwhile, scientists are closely monitoring the eruption's effect on Yellowstone's geothermal features, including its famous geysers. A nation on alert. This eruption, though not on the scale of a supervolcanic event, has reignited concerns about Yellowstone's caldera, one of the most closely watched volcanic systems in the world. Experts will continue to provide updates as they analyze the data. For now, the nation watches with bated breath as Yellowstone reminds the world of its tremendous geological power.